Hello everybody and welcome to Richard's Triplet Piglet Vloglet number five. I think from now on I'm going to call it the TPV because it's much easier to say. It sounds rather cool. The TPV. I like that. Today, dandelions and the scientific theory. First of all, dandelions. I've been out collecting these tonight. The pigs absolutely love them. They go mad for these. A bit like children for ice cream. Let's see how much they love them. Hello girls. What have we got here? What have we got here? Right, I'm going to step over. Step over. Hello. Actually, let's go over here because I need to be in this field for the next bit. Come round. Come round. Come round. Come on. Come round. That's it. That's it. Over here. Here we are. Right, okay. Share them out. Some for you. might be able to see is how much mud they've got on them. Look at Mary here. She's caked in mud. It's been the hottest day of the year today so they've been wallowing in their muddy pool to keep nice and cool. Another time we'll show you how we have to put sun cream on them in the places where they find it difficult to get protection from the sun. Now as they munch on those I will tell you about my scientific theory. A scientific theory is an idea about science, or as some of you older children might call it, a hypothesis. Now while I've been in here interacting with the pigs, I've noticed that when I stand up, they're friendly and they're sociable and they come and say hello and they nuzzle against my welly boots and sometimes uh, scratch the sides of their bodies against my boots as well. But when I get down to their level, when I squat down or I sit down on the floor, that's when I think, they think, it's time to play. And that's when they get a lot more playful. Now they're still munching away, so they're probably not going to want to play right now. So we'll give them a little bit of time. Let's see how much mud they've got up. Look at that. This? this is Berry. Berry must have been sitting in the pool. Look at all that on there. Oh, sorry. And this is, this is Cherry. My goodness, Cherry. Hey, don't fight. They really love the dandelions. Now then, they're nearly finished, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to find a space to sit down and see if they behave any differently when I do. Oh, no fighting. Hello. This might not work, it's just an idea. Hello. That good? Hello. Look at the state of you. Hello. Who would like a tummy rub? <laughs> yep, tummy rub. There we go. It's worked again. Look at that. I was feeling very hot today. Maybe I should have tried rolling around in the mud. In the mud. Uh, to, to cool down. Are you helping? <laughs> Would you like a tummy rub as well? You gonna lie down for a tummy rub? Well, I'm not sure about my scientific theory. Maybe the dandelions was too much of a distraction. But I'm going to try again another time. I think when I get down here, they're more likely to come and play. Hello. Hello, Cherry. Oh, oh, no, no, here we go. Oh, oh, there we are, you see. What are you doing? Ah, don't chew me, knee. Ah! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Ow! I think my theory is right. <laughs> Was that berry? I thought it might. Ow! No biting! <laughs> That's my boot! Stop it! Hey! No! No! What are you doing? No! Steady! Steady! There is the naughty one once again! What are you doing? Get down! 
<laughs> Mind me glasses. <laughs> right, I, I think it's getting a bit dangerous in here. So I'm going to tell the joke of the day, which is, what does a pig put on a cut? Oinkment. I think I might need some of that now. Bye, everybody. Whoa. <laughs>